The next part we're going to draw is the washer. And I'm going to draw the washer on the right plane. So we need to draw on the right plane, right mouse click and sketch. Now we need to draw a circle of 16 millimeters diameter. Draw the circle, smart dimension it to 16 millimeters. And then press the spacebar and isometric. Exit the sketch and we're going to do an extruded boss base for a distance of 5 millimeters. Next one is we're going to turn the model around and we're going to have a look at this face and we're going to extrude another piece off of this face here. So select the face, right mouse click and sketch, select that edge there and we're going to do an offset entity. Now the offset entity wants to be one millimeter away from the edge. So change the number to one and click on reverse. So you've got the line, yellow line inside the blue one. When you've got that, quick to accept the sketch. Exit the sketch. And then we'll do an extruded base boss with that shape again, five millimeters in length. Okay, now we want to go onto the top plane and we want to sketch. And what we're going to do is we're going to draw a circle on the plane. So if we draw our circle somewhere over here, okay, might be better if we look at this straight down up on the top. So we go click on the uh, spacebar and normal two. Change this measurement to 16 millimeters, and the distance from the middle of this circle to this face here, and make it nine millimeters. Okay, there's a little tiny gap there, so what we'll do is we'll change the nine. Just double click on it and change it to 8.5. That should be fine. Click on the sketch to accept it. A spacebar and isometric. Now what we're going to do is we're going to do an extruded cut in using the sketch as a mid plane. So we're going to go extruded cut, mid plane, and just extrude drag the sketch out so it's going to go through everything and click on the sketch. And there we have our washer. Next step we need to do is click on this face and sketch. Now we're going to draw a circle 5mm in diameter on the front. So right mouse uh, click, sorry, um, the space bar and normal 2. Select the circle and draw a circle on here. And make the measurement 5mm. Exit the sketch. Base bar and isometric, extruded cut, make sure it's going through everything. Okay, the easiest way to do that is to click blind on, on the Arab space here and click through all and it will go through everything. And then click the tick to accept. So now what we've got is a, a washer that will allow the face of the cam lever to just rotate in this part here. So space bar, isometric and file and save as washer and that's the end of the third component